Hello, and welcome to Road Trivia, the best daily trivia quiz on YouTube. These 10-minute games each have 20 questions about the category of the day. The question is read aloud, then shown on screen. You'll have 7 seconds to shout out your guest before the answer appears. Come back each day around noon Central Standard Time for a new exciting quiz, and please let us know how many you got correct in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this quiz, please hit the thumbs up button. Alright, it is episode 70, so today we're going to do 1970s trivia. Good luck. Question number one. On May 4th, 1970, members of the National Guard fired into a crowd at which university, killing four students and wounding nine more? The answer is Kent State University. Question number two. When it opened in 1973, the Sears Tower was the tallest building on the planet, now called the Willis Tower, in what city is it located? The answer is Chicago, Illinois. Question number three. In March 1979, a partial meltdown occurred that still ranks as America's worst nuclear incident. Where did this happen? The answer is Three Mile Island, Pennsylvania. Question number four. It was passed by Congress March 23, 1971 and ratified July 1, 1971. What did the 26th Amendment do? The answer is it lowered the voting age from 21 to 18. Question number five. Which horse, perhaps the most famous ever, won the 1973 Triple Crown of Racing and did so with convincing wins? The answer is Secretariat. Question number six. In 1975, Sony released what technology to record home videos? It was short-lived as JVC released the VHS a year later in 1976. The answer is Betamax. Question number seven. Which game by Atari, released in 1972, was the first commercially successful video game? The answer is Pong. Question number eight. How old was Elvis Presley when he died in his house in 1977? The answer is 42 years old. Question number nine. Which actor died just before Enter the Dragon was released to movie theaters in 1973? The answer is Bruce Lee. Question number ten. In 1975, the fall of Saigon marked the end of what? The answer is the Vietnam War. Question 11. Who was elected? President of the United States in 1972?
The answer is Richard Nixon. Question 12. For the first time since 1948, a Soviet citizen was not the world chess champion. What American won that title in 1972? The answer is Bobby Fischer. Question 13. As of 2020, only one NFL team has ever had an undefeated season. In 1972, what team accomplished that feat? The answer is the Miami Dolphins. Question 14. In September 1970, what guitar hero died of a drug overdose in London at just 27 years old? The answer is Jimi Hendrix. Question 15. In 1976, who was elected to replace Gerald Ford as U.S. President? The answer is Jimmy Carter. Question 16. Who won the men's decathlon in the 1976 Summer Olympics? The answer is Bruce Jenner. Question 17. The line, Houston, we have a problem, was famously uttered aboard what troubled space flight? The answer is Apollo 13. Question 18. On January 1st, 1971, during The Tonight Show with Johnny Carson, the last televised ad for what brand of cigarettes aired? The answer is Virginia Slims. Question 19. In what year was the world's first test tube baby born? The answer is 1978. Question 20. In 1972, Richard Nixon became the first U.S. president to visit which country? The answer is China. All right, that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed the 1970s quiz. Come back tomorrow for a new quiz with a new category. If you have a suggestion for a category you'd like to be quizzed on, just leave us a message below. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow.